I'm Richie. And I'm Shelly. And today we're going to go to the Golden Corral. It's a buffet restaurant. It's a buffet. It's a chubby person's dream. I'm Troy. And I'm Ty. <laughs> this is our posse. Yeah, this is our Golden Corral posse. Yeah. Yeehaw! <laughs> Have you guys ever been to the Golden Corral? Why yes, why yes, why yes. Oh, is it a big Midwest thing? It is indeed. Oh, look at that. <laughs> he lives in California for 10 years or more and he still has an accent. <laughs> Can't take the boy out of Missouri. Ty and Troy are brother and sister. Yay! And Troy's out here visiting from Kansas. Kansas. <laughs> How do you like uh, California so far? I love the weather, I love the state, but the drivers, they're driving me bananas. Yeah, they're bad. <laughs> oh Lord. Now what kind of foods do they have at the, at the OK Corral? Golden Corral. They have all kinds of potato products, which you know I love. I love the mashed potatoes, and they have this delicious thing called bourbon chicken. Oh. And they have rice, and they have cornbread, and they have little slider hamburgers, and they had, I think they had spaghetti somewhere. Yeah, I didn't even make it over to the salad bar. I didn't even go to the healthy side. Yes. <laughs> Just stayed Why, in. when you go to Golden Corral, would you want to eat healthy? <laughs> That's exactly right. Forget the salad. You can have salad every day. That's at home. true. There for the mashed potatoes. Yeah. And, um, the chocolate cake. Oh, I didn't get to the dessert. I only got like two things off the dessert bar. When we went, there was a uh, large group of a certain religious affiliation. It was a nice uh, group of kids. They were like from the Mormons. There was too many of them. I couldn't even get near the dessert bar. There had to be what thirty of them. But I just they were they were hogging up the food. <laughs> <laughs> they were hogging up my dessert. Oh, and I noticed they even had like uh, chocolate dipped strawberries. Oh, I think it, I think they had strawberries and marshmallows and yeah something else you could dip in chocolate. I think they have pizzas too. Oh yeah, they had two pizzas. They had chick uh, cheese and pepperoni. Oh okay, I like pizza. The salad bar was like like a desert. Like I don't think anybody even like went there. You have to roll. You have to kind of roll yourself back to your car. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Last time we went, remember we sat in the car for like 20 minutes because we were so full. We were like, no, no. look at the Jolly Jug. How come we don't go to Jolly Jolly Jug? That looks like a good place. We should remember that. Oh, uh, you know who Jolly used to go jug. to Jolly Jug? Mm -hmm. Dolly. <laughs> <laughs> so where, what parts of LA have you both uh, visited or? All over. Of course, I've been here before, so Santa Monica. <sighs> And I've camped on the beach up in Malibu. Oh, wow, look at you. Ooh, yeah. Was that when you came with your family? Yes. Oh, okay. Is that your favorite place? Yes, that is my favorite place of all time. Yeah, Malibu's beautiful when it's not on fire. Right. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what it is about Malibu. It's always on fire. It's just, you know, but I'm like, knock on wood. We haven't really had any bad fires so far this year. Thank God. What happened to the boo? That's what we Californians call it, the boo. That's right. Because we're really cool. Yeah. And you guys have been to West Hollywood. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Because we went out to the famous Cantor's Deli last weekend. Yes. It was delicious. So what did you have at Cantor's? I had my usual brisket beef dip and with the barbecue sauce. Okay. And I had a salad and a fruit cup. What did you guys have? I had a pastrami sandwich. What did you have? Oh, there's nothing like a Reuben from Cantor's. Oh, and then we left. We had <laughs> we bought lots of arugula. We did, Shelly. We did indeed. We did indeed. If you don't know what arugula is, it's a, I think it's a kind of a traditional Jewish bakery item. It's just like a rolled dough and it has a filling of like chocolate or they have raspberry, they have apple, they have coconut. Very, very good. The chocolate one comes with all these lovely chocolate chips all over the top of it. And they are so delicious. 
I'm so hungry. Are you, you know what I always say, and I know this sounds terrible. Yeah. Don't write any bad comments because it's not meant in a bad way. I always say I'm turning Ethiopian. <laughs> 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 and I know, I know it sounds terrible. There's a pawn shop. Pawn shops everywhere. That's a big pawn yeah, shop. I like sound. that sign. I got jewelry and loan. I want some jewelry. I want a big blinky watch. Oh, there you go. Yeah. Richard wants a Rolex. I don't know why. He's not quite the Rolex kind of guy. I want a Rolex Oyster Perpetual, uh, the stainless steel one. How much is that Rolex? If you can find one. Uh -huh. uh, about $6,000. Oh, you got $6,000 just rolling around in your bank account? Oh, or? yeah. It's expensive, but it's something you have to like kind of earn. You have to like accomplish something in your life that you can say, okay, I'm going to treat myself to, to a Rolex. So right now I'm working on a Casio. A casket? Casio. Casio. <laughs> <laughs> if you want an old man watch, that's the way to go. Yeah. There's nothing speaks of quality than a watch made out of rubber and plastic. Hey, this looks like the east side of LA. No, we ain't in no east side. We're in the city of industry. Wait, that's so what dangerous. I hope we don't run into any bandidos. I got my machete. Yeah, let's go to the nudie bar. We're not going to a nudie bar. No, yeah, but there's one right over there. And then... There's a lot of nudie bars out this Ooh, way. Oh, another one. Yeah, there's going to be a sex shop oh, coming up. Oh, my goodness. That's yeah. Like... I want to go to the titty bar. Titty bar. <laughs> titty bar. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go to feed our guts. Hey, we need a new muffler. A new muffler. Yeah, I want a muffler. I'd like to muffle you. Oh, let's go to McDonald's instead. I want McDonald's. Oh, I don't want no McDonald's. No. I want, I want cornbread. That's my, ugh, I don't feel like going anywhere else place. Like McDonald's is like the default restaurant when you're just too lazy to drive the extra exactly. block to go someplace else. Exactly, totally. Are we there yet? Almost. Not too far. 12 minutes to fat people heaven. Woo! Woo! You're not as cool as me. I'm cool. Yeah, you're kind of a nerd. You're my nerdy friend. When we were kids growing up and we would be like, we're thirsty. My mom would stick her thumb in the back and say, here, suck my thumb. <laughs> and we're like, who? What is that gonna do? <laughs> What's your favorite restaurant? Uh, Golden Corral. Really? really? <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so we just stayed at the Golden Corral, so what's the verdict, Shelly? Oh, it was really good. I always enjoyed the food, but I'm too full. Way too full. What did you think? It was great. What about you, Ty? It was fantastic. My favorite are the, the burger sliders with the with the onions. I have pot roast. Pot the roast? Pot roast was delicious with the mashed potatoes. Fish was just awesome. Oh, all right. What about you, Ty? And the fried chicken with biscuits and gravy. Oh yeah, the biscuits and of course the mashed potatoes and gravy. Oh. It was mighty good. It was good.